Yes, sir. Another one. Mm hmm. Yep. You read the title right. I was surprised myself. I'll be shocked every time I do. Every time I do this, I'll be like, "Damn, that's crazy!" Because these are artists I grew up off of. So we just talked about the east side. So now we well, now we gonna talk about the west side. So what really happened to Doughboy Rock? Let's find out. Y'all like the stream too. Now, Doughboy Rock, for those who don't know, was a part of a group called Doughboy's Cash Out. Now, they was uh, stamps in the city. Everybody knows who they are. Like I said, they're not like industry plants. We all knew them. So you have Payroll, Giovanni, you have Doughboy Rock, you have Kid, you have Keese, and you have Dre. Now, Payroll Giovanni is the only one out of this whole group that has any type of relevancy in the music industry. And they even signed to Young Jeezy at one point, might I add. They were signed to Young Jeezy at one point, back in 2013, I believe. So, now, Payroll Giovanni. Um, the Dope Boys Cash Out rapper was murdered on Detroit's West Side. Now, the news of this came out October 10th, 2017. And just a few months later, Payroll Giovanni signs with Def Jam. Just him. Not the not the whole group or anything. Just just payroll. So that's when I start digging deeper and saying, okay, it's something about this. So I said, okay, let's let's go ahead and see then. So I did the numbers. And like I said, this was the news of the death. But the death day was October 9th. So if we take the days after Doughboy Rock died to the day that Payroll signed his new deal was a span of 73 days, just like sacrifice equals 70, 73 What that mean just because you from Detroit? Nigga, I'm from Detroit. So what that mean? What that mean? Just because you from there. You could just be a stupid nigga from there. But come on. Sacrifice equals 73. Now we're taking the English language, you know, like we always do. We're taking the English language, right? A is 1. Z is 26. And this is what we always get. The same connections. Right? Doughboy Rock, Detroit rapper, shot and killed at 29. And shot and killed also equals 73. Remember the same shot and killed from the last video. The same one. The same phrases. And we get 73 as well. But well, let's dive deeper. Now they say Rock was sitting inside his white Hyundai near an abandoned field outside a house at Stople Street and Westfield Avenue near I-96 and Livernois Avenue in Detroit, Michigan, where, quote unquote, somebody shot him. Second precinct captain John Serta in Detroit told the Detroit News, why the hell did they need to say that? Why did they need to say this was already obvious? They just told us already that he was shot and killed. So what is the reason 
that they just sat here and put somebody shot him in quotations. But once again, they're giving you the code like they always do. Somebody shot him. Equals 73. Now, don't ban him from the chat. Let them let them see here because that's all these niggas do. They, they run their mouth, but they still sit here and watch. So let that nigga watch. You nigga be running all their mouth, talking all that shit, but they be right here, front and center, every time I go live. Well, come on. 73. Sacrifice 73. 73 days. He was shot and killed. 73. And then they like to tell you that somebody shot him, which was already obvious. Somebody shot him equals 73. Yes, that's all they do is drop codes. But check this out, though. Check this out. Once again, the day that Doughboy, got, Doughboy Rock got shot and killed to the day that payroll signed his deal was a span of two months, one week and five days two fifteen, just like payroll Giovanni. And once again, the code that they gave you, somebody shot him. And we get two fifteen. And we get 215 with the same phrase, somebody shot him. So damn, is they is they is they saying something? <laughs> what they what they saying about this? And what's so crazy, right? With the 215, check this out. Doughboy Rock was born on the 215th day of the year. On the 215th day of the year, he dies two months, one week, and five days before payroll signs his deal when payroll Giovanni equal 215. Come on, man. Once again, man, the day... That payroll signed his deal, man, was on the second month and the 13th day of Rock's death. Just like death equals 213 in Satanic. That's 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 crazy that you called that right there. That's crazy that you called that right there. Remember, you said that. Remember, you said that. Now. Also, with the 213 once again, which we all know is linked to death, uh, the mixtape that he dropped before Rock's death, uh, he dropped it 21 weeks in three days. Just like once again, death equals 213. And we keep getting the same synchronicities. Now, what's so crazy is this mixtape dropped on the 132nd day of the year. The mixtape was called Payface and Payface equals 132 in reverse, the English language backwards. Yeah, I agree with that, but not this. My bro, I don't care how long you've been listening to me. And see, that's what's wrong with these little dick sucking ass niggas. These niggas don't know you. They don't know you. I don't give a fuck how long you've been listening to them. I just told I grew up off of these niggas, but the truth is the truth. It is what it is. Nigga, I can't sugarcoat shit. Just because they just because they from where I'm from. So I got to shy away from talking about certain shit. No, that ain't what we doing over here. Y'all better take y'all ass over somewhere else. So y'all can have a payroll listening party or something. But that ain't what we finna do over here. Now, 
Once again, they give you the code. Rodney Jurgen. He was found dead around 3.30 p.m. They put their stamp on that. They put their stamp on that. And even Payface equals 33. And what's so crazy, check this out. Doughboy Rock passed away exactly three months and three weeks before Payroll's birthday. They putting a stamp on it. They putting a stamp on it. They favorite strangers. You need to be so upset about they favorite strangers. I, I knew this was going to fuck the city up. That's why I couldn't wait to do it. I couldn't wait. I love hurting you niggas feelings. Now, even the day that Doughboy Rock got killed, it left 83 days left in the year. Just like murder equals 83 in Detroit, Michigan, where he got killed at equals 83 in reduction. Even his birthday, even Rock's birthday was August 3rd, 8 slash 3. What's the odds of that? What's the odds of that? Now, let's talk about the day that he got shot. October 9th, in other words, 10 slash 9, 109. This was the day that he got caught in a shooting when shooting equals 109. But what's so crazy? What's so crazy about this is if we break down 109, we get the 29th prime number, just like he died at age 29 on 29 date numerology. This was a ritual once again. 29. Just like payroll. Payroll was 29 years old when it happened. Payroll was 29 years old when it happened. Didn't you say, didn't you say something about an Aquarius and air signs? So little lady already called it. She said most of these most of these celebrities be air signs. And payroll is an Aquarius. Aquarius and shooting once again with the 109 connected to the day that he got shot. 109. And Aquarius and shooting had the same synchronicity. Now, once again, somebody shot him, right? With the 215 synchronicity, along with the ordinal and the satanic cipher. Once again, shooting 109. His next project, Big Boss in Volume 2, came out 109 days. After Doughboy Rock's death on 10 slash 9. With shooting equals 109. Y'all see how this go? What's the odds of that? What's the odds of that? Now, even the day of the year. That he got killed October 9th was on the 282nd day of the year, which happened to be a Monday when Monday 
equals 282 in satanic. Rodney, which was his first name, ritual, in the day that he got killed on Monday, are all synchronized with 81 and 27. He even passed away 36 weeks after payroll's birthday. Which Rodney, once again, his first name equals 36. Once again, he also passed away eight months and one week. After payroll's birthday. Which ritual in Rodney equals 81? This was a ritual right in front of you. If people are too stupid to see it, that ain't on me. But it is what it is. These niggas be so hurt over other grown men. It's so crazy that I don't be seeing no women be, be angry like that. It always be these little gay ass niggas. These little feminine energy ass niggas. That be so hurt about something another grown man say. So emotionally invested about another grown man's opinion. That shit is weird to me. That shit is so weird to me. I don't never see. I don't never see no women like Kenfo. Fuck you. Payroll would never do that. I don't never hear no women do that. It's always dudes. That's so weird to me. How did the roles like reverse like this? How did we get here in this in this in this position, like in the world? Where it's the men that act like this and not the women. But come on. Human sacrifice. Doughboy Rock passed away 67 days after his own birthday. Just like human sacrifice equals 67. Now check this out. Even payroll's birthday, which was January 30th, written 1 slash 30, human sacrifice equals 130. Detroit, Michigan, where Rock got killed at 130. So it's like, it's like, bro, this shit is so it's it's so obvious at this point. I wish I had a new this. I wish I had a new Jamatria at the time that this happened. And that's and that's why I'm dumb. That's why I'm going back on all the old shit that had happened already. And I'm seeing what happened. I wish I had a new this at the time. But everything happened for a reason. Now also with Detroit. Now we know Detroit, Michigan equals 113, the number of deception. Disinfo, bullshit, illusions, not true, not honest, not factual, broadcasting. A lot of other words, broad, uh, uh, green screen, infidelity, divorce. All those other words, right? But it's so crazy that 113, now we just seen in the PZ video, how the news showed you the 113. Remember how the news did that? So why they do it again? Why did they do it again? <laughs> why did the news do it again with Doughboy Rock after they just did it with Bacon Soda Snoop? Why did they do the 113 again? They happened to start talking about it at 1103. Now, you, this is the damn news. You know everything is on time. This was purposely done. This at zero, zero point zero zero, nigga, the beginning of the video. They start talking about the death of Doughboy Rock at exactly 1103. Bullshit. They finna, the narrative that they about to tell you is bullshit. 
and they know it. That's why they're giving you the numbers. That's why they give me. That's that's why they're giving it to you like this. And peep the red. She wearing hot pink. Got the red car in the back. They showing you, bro. They showing you. They showing you was a blood sacrifice. Just like, just like Team Eastside Snoop. Just like Bacon Soda Snoop. 10-13. There they go with the 113 again. Then it just happened to be 33 degrees outside. <laughs> Could have been 32, 34. It probably was. And here they go color coding with the black and red too. And here they go giving you the same code. They just happen to be. This is a screenshot straight from Fox 2 News uh, website. And they just happen to do it at 1013. They keep on. They keep on telling you. Even Dope Boy Rock died 113 days before Payroll's birthday. 113 days. Come on, man. It's right in front of you. What's the odds? What's the odds, man? Even Rodney Jurgen. Doughboy Rock's full name, first and last name, equals 191 in reverse. The English language in reverse. Now, if we break down 191, it's the 43rd prime number. Just like killing equals 43. It's so like I said, man, they take the numerology around your rap name, your birthday, your real name. And that's how they figure this out. And that's how they figure it out, bro. He even passed away two months, zero weeks, and six days before payroll's birthday. Just like sacrifice equals 206. And what do you know? They just happened to be showing a picture of Doughboy Rock and his mama at 602, the reverse of 206. Everything they do is planned. Everything. Everything. <laughs> he said this is crack for real. <laughs> I'm sick. But yeah, that's all we got, man. That's all we got for this presentation, man. Appreciate y'all for the love, man. All the support. Y'all like the stream on y'all way out. Yeah, everything's a coincidence. That That's how we're going to lead this. We're going to lead that with everything is a coincidence. <laughs> Talking about there's more. No, that's it. I mean, it, pro it, it probably is more, to be honest. It's always more. But yeah, that's all we got for this video, man. Appreciate y'all, man. And I'm gone.